flossing. Choosing the proper dental floss is really important. There are wax flosses, unwaxed flosses, microfiber flosses, yarns that you can use, super floss. A lot of the flosses have flavors, bubblegum, raspberry. Choose the best one for your patient. That will motivate them to floss. When you use floss, what you want to do is make sure that you're using an arm's length of floss. I use my middle fingers. You can use your ring fingers. For the dirty floss, you're going to do is a little bit. And for the clean floss, you're going to make a nice long spool and a very short one for the dirty floss. So this is going to become my dirty hand and this is going to become my clean hand. You want to use your thumb and your index fingers and use about an inch of floss in between there. When you floss, you always want to start with the distal of the last tooth, and you want to also always try to get a system to what you're doing so you're not haphazardly going all over. Place the, flo place the floss on the distal of the last tooth, and then up and down three times. One, two, three. Come out, take the dirty piece of floss, put it on that hand, take the clean off the other hand. Okay, now we're going to go in between the teeth where there's contacts. I have a clean piece of floss now. I'm going to go in between teeth with two contacts. Seesawing in between the teeth. Going in a good C and up and down three times. One, two, three. And then I'm going to come up and over the papilla without coming out. Okay, one, two, three. And seesawing out. The reason you want to seesaw in between the teeth is so you don't create lacerations on the papillae with the dental floss. Once you're in the contact, you want to wrap it around. One, two, three, and up and over the papillae. One, two, three. Seesaw out so that the floss doesn't break or fray. If you pull it straight out, it has a tendency to break. Clean piece of floss in between the teeth. Sometimes you hear a snapping. You want to try to avoid that. With the type of ton, it's kind of like impossible. But the real mouth, oops, see it popped out again. You want to stay in there. One, two, three. And notice how both fingers or both hands are going up and down together. One isn't just doing it by itself. Clean piece of floss. Seesaw in between the teeth. Good C wrap. One, two, three. Opposite way. One, two, three, seesawing out. I'm going to do this again systematically and then move over to the upper arch. Dental floss.